negative is not good. Negative is not happy. Negative gives you ugly wrinkles. I have one wrinkle I still can't get rid of from a boss I had when I was working in a law office. <laughs> I've been working on that wrinkle for years. That's Roberta Long. I met her a few years back and she's a trip, folks. You're going to love her. This master class is the ability to laugh at yourself and to find the humor in yourself and to be able to laugh at it. And that's exactly what Roberta does. I'm going to let her do what she does. Enjoy her. I could be miserable like everybody else was. Oh, that's just not me. I, do, I don't have it in me. Getting to the point where I can get my husband to laugh about things that he wouldn't have in the past like. because he's so serious about things. Getting lost, even coming here today, how's that a, for a good one? I got lost in the parking lot, just like I did the last time I went to see you. I got lost in the parking lot. There had been back then, he would have just, when he was much younger, yeah, 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 yeah. How can, don't you, you know, just the usual, why can't you find your way? Now he calls me the U-turn queen of Garden Grove, <laughs> and he thinks it's hilarious, and I'm directionally challenged, and he finds it amusing, and why belabor the fact? Beverly was driving me home one day. We missed the street, and I said, I think we were supposed to turn there, and she said, oh, okay, and turned around and made a U-turn. My best is four U-turns for one street. <laughs> I choose not to be down. People forget that smiling is a choice. And it'll come naturally if you work on it long enough. And I've chosen to work on it for a long time. Now, do I smile all the time? Of course not. Do I, am I happy all the time? No, I'm a normal person. Okay, I don't just laugh. I don't just laugh because laughter is a gut thing that comes from the inside because you're feeling something that deserves laughter. I had a boss that said, I love your giggle. Show me how you do it. <laughs> You can't show somebody how you giggle. It just comes. <laughs> laughter can't mask my feelings because I can't fake laughter. I can't just bring it up. If, if I need to laugh about something, I'm not a bit shy about putting a movie on that makes me laugh hysterically. By the same token, if I have some pent up frustration, I'll put on something that makes me cry. Really? Yes. So it's important to cry sometimes. Oh, yes. And Explain. a good tear jerker is, well, Sometimes you're so tight. Sometimes it's just, and you can't, there's no way you can get it loose. It's, I mean, other than yell at your husband, which is a great sport, but it gets tired of it. It's a good thing he's deaf because it's kind of hard on him. But you get, you get so tight. Life is too short to mess it up with crap. I probably shouldn't use that word. But it's just, you just can't mess stuff up. You've got to keep it fair, balanced, even, humor, fun. Ah. There's that word fun, the root of funny. And now Roberta's going to bring the fun and the funny in a true story about suicide. Dwight and I had just visited with a friend, and it was the captain of the ship he was on when he was in the Navy, and he was dying. He was in his hospital bed, and he had um, set a calendar up that he was going to uh, complete certain things by certain dates, and then on the last day, if he wasn't dead, he was going to commit suicide. And we were invited. <laughs> so, to a suicide party? Yes, so the, the whole thing. And so I'm in tears, of course. And Dwight and I get out to the car, and I calm down, and I look at him, and I'm thinking about this, and I said, Dwight, what does one wear to a suicide? <laughs> and it totally diffused it. It totally diffused it. So the final question I asked Roberta was, what's your take on people that say, I can't laugh at that? You shouldn't laugh at that. If I've been told I shouldn't laugh, I couldn't laugh, I'm not supposed to laugh, it's inappropriate. Tough. <laughs> <laughs> really? Tough nutted stucks? I mean, I'm serious. <laughs> tough nutted stucks. I love that. And she's serious. She's serious about finding the humor and laughing at herself and the world around her, and also what makes her uncomfortable. Folks, thank you for joining this master class. You know, you can go to yjhtl.com, which is short for You Just Have to Laugh, yjhtl.com. That'll link you to the podcast. That'll link you to uh, the more master classes, because you're already here. Check out the other master classes. They're wonderful. Also, the wonderful books we have about how humor and laughter can get you through the most difficult times in life and love. We'll see you at the next Nestor class. Thanks for joining us. And please don't forget to find the fun and the funny in yourself and laugh right through it.